In this video, I am going to show you how to reset a Cisco 3750 switch to the factory ready phone. I am going to do that for the bottom switch here. First, you have to turn off the switch and then hold down this mode button. You have to hold down around 30 seconds and you see this, the light, first light, the system uh, light. When it start to turn off, you can release the mode button. So I am going to hold this button. I am going to power this switch. Okay. Now it's turned off. Just you can release now. And then let's go to the switch and see what it is doing. Okay, I am at the console now. And what you have to do is so just you have to initialize the flash to do that type in flash flash in it okay it is initializing the flash look at the dir flash okay these are the files in this the flash you have to delete some files here so you have to delete vlan dot that so to do that you type in dele delete flash vlan dot dat and it's asking you are you sure you want to delete delete it and you also have to delete a couple of other files here. Now go and look at the flash again. DAR flash. Okay, we run that is gone. So you have to delete config.txt. So de delete flash config dot text text yes that is also deleted you have to delete config backup also here flash paste it here yes now type dir flash that's all you have now and now type boot it will reload the configuration and now you will get factory default settings that means it's like you are getting the switch a brand new switch from the factory and now the switch rebooted and if you see the message here would you like to enter the initial configuration dialog yes no that means you have restored this switch to the factory default and you say no and you are in the switch configuration and then there's no password to enter a brand new switch and look at so switch and one thing you have to do is if you see the uh, switch number it says two that means it was part of a stack before uh, and slot number two but when you add this switch to the new stack what you have to do is you have to reset any switch that goes to a stack to switch number one so t switch to re number one confirm yes switch okay i know why that is happening i need to reboot the switch for this renumbering to take effect right mem reload confirm and then i had to wait for the switch to restart okay now the switch restarted enable so switch 
okay you see here now this become as a master ready and this become as a provision one what we have to do is if you look at show run so you have two switches but actually you supposed to have one switch right switch one the switch two need to go Conti no switch to provision and then grab this one and paste it here and write mem show run and you will not see second switch here so switch that is gone 